This one's on PPA Purge. Basically, it's a good tool to downgrade a package that you've added from a PPA. Uh, so let me give you an example here. Okay, I have uh, Easy Stroke install. Uh, this one here. What I'm gonna do is add a PPA and get a newer version and uh, downgrade it. Okay. So here's their PPA. Um, all you do is copy this link here or this uh, line here. All right and copy that. Uh, I'm going to bust out terminal here and now we're going to add the repository so sudo uh, add apt repository and then you paste in whatever you just copy just enter and what it did is add the deb line and I uh, got the key for you now we're going to do an update sudo apt get update alright uh, to refresh the list uh, let's clear this. Uh, now that you have it, uh, you know your repositories. Now we're gonna upgrade the the uh, was that our uh, Easy Stroke version. So let me do that. sudo get install Easy Stroke. Oops, Stroke. And is uh, is downloading the new version and installing the new version. Okay, so now that we have that. Um, what this one does, it, this one is called uh, PPA Purge, like I said, uh, and what it does is basically uh, downgrades uh, the package from the PPA and disables the PPA. It doesn't delete it, it just, you know, disables it, okay? So all you have to do is sudo PPA Purge here, and then you just paste in the PPA line that you copied earlier, alright? And what that does is it downgrades it here. Alright, so it tells you, uh, do you want to uh, downgrade this package? You see that? And all you do is hit yes here, and that's it. And you're back to uh, whatever you had before, okay? And like I said, they disable the, the deadline uh, for that uh, in your software sources. Uh, basically, that's how the program works. Now, if you want to install it, it's just um, what is it here? sudo apt-get install and ppa purge here. That's how you would install it. Uh, it's in your repositories already. All right. So that's it. Uh, just hit enter, and it'll tell you uh, if you want to install it or whatever. Oh, they actually have a, a different one here. Anyways, that's how you would install it uh, from your Lucid uh, repositories. That's it. Uh, pretty cool and pretty convenient. All right.